Well, hello everyone. This is Jennifer Scott from Slides Yearbook, and I have a room full of one, two, three, four, five, six Slides Yearbook students. Say hello, everyone. Hi. Hi. Hello, my name Hi. is Nancy. Yes, and, and Nancy wants to say hello to the entire world. <laughs> now, what we're doing today is we're looking at student examples. These are our favorite examples of the lesson we covered in fourth period yearbook class. And our job was to learn how to fill color with what's already there, how to use customized color, to play with gradients, and to use the extension Colorzilla. So we're going to look at your favorite work and we're going to talk about what we like about it. The first example is the teacher example and I call her Hannah Banana. Can anyone tell me what you like about this? Yes ma'am. Okay, so what I like about this slide is that it's like, it's about Coco and it's like a type of Mexican cut and all that. Yes, so, so how many of you guys have watched the movie Coco? Me. me. How many of you cried in it? Me. Not me. Do you know someone who did? Not yes. me. Uh, some people are just denying. So we have the movie Coco, and this absolutely positively was created in Google Slides, and all of these are examples of word art with edges, yes? yes. With, uh, with shapes and so on. All right, let's continue. Now, who wants to start with this example? What do you like about it? How did the student create this design? Yes, ma'am. Um, what I like about it is what it's saying and the colors, the, what it's saying and the colors kind of blend. How so? Because when it's saying if it doesn't challenge you, it won't change you, it's like, I don't know, motivating you. So red is a vibrant color, and we start with one color red, and we change, ooh, the word change, at the bottom, yes? Yeah. All right, looking good. All right, who wants to talk about this example? Now, do you know how it was created, first of all? No. No, okay, so just tell me what you like about it, and then I'll show you how it was created, go. Okay, uh, I like how um, the blue blends in with the yellow and the pink how the both pictures like fit them together now I'm going to show you how this was created we have an extension which you can't see right over here called colorzilla and when I click on page color picker act active I get this X and I'm coming down to his hair and when I click on it I get a copy of that color so I look at the background and I change the color and this is how it was created. I just created that color with the picker. And that's where it came from. And I'm repeating myself, but you forgive me, yes? Yes. All right, so, and that's a slight difference because he actually probably moved to a lighter color over here. And do you guys see where the pink came from in the picture? Yes. yes. I'm not sure where the shade of yellow came from, but it does pop out. I think it's just inspired by Dr. Seuss. All right. Who would like to talk about this design? Me. Go for it, sir. I like how it has, like, how in the bottom, you like, some picture, like, it's all pure um, purple. And I like how he put, or she put, that white color that doesn't, like, make it hard to read. Oh, so if it doesn't, it has this white border around it. Yeah. So she could use purple, but it pops out. Yeah. Now, what do you guys notice about the word challenge and change? They're gradients. They are gradients. Does anyone know how to create a gradient? Me. Um, All right, what website do we go to? Uh, U UI Gradients. Yeah. And when I come here, I can click on these edges over here. I can come and I have all these choices. And when I look at this example, I notice that we have solid and we have gradient. And we can come down to custom. And this is how it is created. Now, this design, all of the colors are done by Reagan. What inspired Reagan to do these colors? Anyone? The fox and socks. You see the fox and the socks over here? So you see the red and the fox is also the red and the other colors. And then the blue that's in value of a moment is also in here. And okay. That, that peach is also like the book cover. It is exactly that. Nicely done. Who wants to talk about this one? 
Go for it, Hallelujah. Okay, so what I really like about this one is the gradients in the background because it's showing a lighter blue and a darker blue and then the, like, I don't know, the shine to it. And then in the words, it's different colors that blend together, like the blue to the darker blue mixed with the purple and then like a light, a light or hot pink. All right. I think that background is not a gradient. I think she found that on there and just added it as her background. What do you think? And then where she has remember the moments, those are, that's the gradients, yes? Yeah. Okay. Who wants to talk about this one? We've seen this quote already, but this one is obviously different. Me? Go for it, sir. Um, it's like the, I like the how. For some reason, I like how he changes or she changes uh, the colors, and then he he rotates them to so they could really like Doctor Seuss thing. Oh, because Doctor Seuss was not a person who always wrote straight in the line. He was kind of different. Yeah. Yes, ma'am. But one thing I want to know, where did the yellow came out from? That is true. Are these colors coming from the picture? No. I think the blue looks like it comes from, from the picture. Yes. Yeah. Maybe a little bit of that pink, but the, I, I totally... The I red. all the colors are just inspired from the Dr. Seuss's, like, um, I don't know, books. Like, in, like inspires all of his books together. Have all of his books together, together just yeah. feels like Dr. Seuss. Do you choose colors just because they're your favorite colors? No. no. Why should you because choose a color? You have to make make it also like blend in and make it like it make sense. It has to make sense, doesn't it? That that is a fabulous thing to say, Nancy. Okay, what about this one? Ooh, I, I got it. Go for it, Uriel. I like how it's like it's soccer and it's like the words are also combined like with the soccer field. It's like blue and gray at the bottom. So we have like the blue of the soccer field, we have the green of the soccer field. Awesome. What do you notice about the soccer ball? Oh, it has this quote um, by there. Oh, the name who said this quote and who, who made this design. Yeah. Did you find any other students who had a picture like Jeremy did? No. no. That's what makes it stand out, doesn't it? Yes. And he was very careful how he put those names, yes? Yes. What did he do around the word art? He, he like made, made it a white outline. How does the white outline help on this very busy background? Um, Makes the letters and stuff pop out. All right, now we have a Doctor Who. Okay, yes, sir. I like how she uses like the same exact colors from Doctor Who, and I like how her fonts are like almost almost exact like Doctor Who's. It makes you think of the television show, yes? Yeah. Now, can you believe there are some people who did this quote and they had whatever color they wanted? It just didn't work. Oh, and thank you, Freedom, for bringing me my, my TARDIS plush toy. I do appreciate that, sir. So if it, do, if it doesn't, if the colors don't go with the television show, if the colors don't go with what you're talking about, it just clashes, yes? Yeah, it just makes sense. Who wants to talk about this one? Go for it, young lady. So what makes me like this color that, that makes it outstand is that it's like Dr. Seuss from Lorax here. Yes. And it like matches the image and how it looks to me. Because we originally had a different uh, book, didn't we? Yes. But she decided, no, I'm different. I'm going to go find a different book because this is my favorite book and I'm going to use colors from it. All right, who wants to talk about this one? This is written made by Heavenly. Yes, hallelujah. Okay, so. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> okay, hallelujah. So I really like this one because this is kind of, um, I don't know, like something that you should hear in your life. And then the background is just like very meaningful because it's a sunset. and then the Or a sunrise. Ooh. One, it's like a beach, though it's like really pretty. And then um, the colors on the, um, the colors of the letters makes it stand out because it's, I don't know, it's just. And she's different. Yeah. And it honestly looks like it could be heaven up there, which goes with her name, right? Yes. But like, it's like from heaven and it's heaven, it's made by heavenly. All right. Now this right here is also on the Lorax, but you chose to keep this. How is this different from the other one? Oh, because um, the other 
other person use the oh, uh, pink? Above the the light color? Pink more bright, and he's like using it like more darker, and I like how he uses um, the color from the Lorax picture. And, and the background is matching the um, like the middle truffle tree. Oh, the truffle tree. Got you. Okay, what about this one? Now, Daviana did something completely different. This wasn't even our quote. So she in Heavenly chose something different. Why do you like this design? Yes, sir. Because the same the same colors from the words and the background from the Grinch are the same. So he, the colors come from the Grinch, which just makes you think this is the Grinch story. Yes? yes. Nicely done. And Christmas. All right, Annabelle's. What do you guys think? I like Annabelle's because it's like, I don't know, it's just like, I just like it because it kind of matches with the... The Doctor Who theme, yes, and the TARDIS, and, yes, and everything. And it just, I don't know, it just makes it out. It, I don't know, I just like it. Something about it makes sense to me, and I like it. All right, what do you think about this one? Oh, it's like, like a black hole. Oh, different yes. colors, like the paint. Are you doing a metaphor that we have a challenge and this metaphor, this black hole's trying to pull you in and what are you doing? You're trying to pull out. So, I love that. High five me, girlfriend. Don't leave me hanging. So you love it. looks like a black hole. That's what it reminds you. It looks like it's a challenge. So the colors and the design make sense. And it outstands. It's like, yeah. Know. All right. What do you guys think about this one? Oh, yes, yes, Nancy. So what I like about this is that the image, how it does like pinkish and yellowish and the blue and all that, it just, I don't know, it just outstands it to me and it just, you got, to, you could read it and... Does it make you feel like yes. you are about to read the book? Yes. Oh, yes. the places you'll go? They yes. the letters um, from the book. They take the color of the letters. So you're looking at you're looking at in particular the balloon, yes. Yeah, yes. Yellow. So what color are the, was the balloon? Um, the pink and yellow. And what colors do you have? Sometimes you will. Some, yeah. All right. So we have now completed all of these. Tell me what each one. Which one was your absolute absolute favorite, Nancy? My favorite one was um, slide. Um, 31? Yes, yes, like 31. The one that made you think of the black yes. hole as a challenge. Yes. Okay, hallelujah. Which one's your favorite? Um, I think you would also be um, slide 31 because of the black hole. What do you think, Jennifer? Oh, she's being quiet. Okay, Uriel. I think the, the, the other Doctor Who. Do you, so we had this Doctor Who, yeah. and then we had this Doctor Who. You like this one better? Yeah. Why is this one better? Because I like how he changed, or she changed the words on the bottom. Like from, it looks like a like light. Oh, so each of these is different. Yeah. Oh, nicely done. All right, Isabel, what's your favorite? Slide 33. 33? <laughs> you guys really like, oh, you the 33, the one about oh, the places you'll go? It makes me, like, it, looking at it, it would rather make you in a good mood or uh, make you think about something. So colors change your mood. I think this is a fabulous job. Can you guys say goodbye to everybody? Goodbye. goodbye. Thanks for listening. And that was a fabulous and lesson. Good. Thank you.